List Segmentation 101 When you have a mailing list, it's useful to think of this as a valuable resource. You can potentially gain a lot of hot leads from this list and convert a lot of your subscribers into paying customers. But that's only true if you use your list correctly and don't abuse or exhaust the opportunity. One way to make sure you get the most from your mailing list is to use list segmentation. In this presentation, I'll discuss what that is and how it works. Let's start with a definition. List segmentation is the process of dividing your mailing list into groups, allowing you to send more targeted messages. That means that you might target your readers based on their age, their sex, their geographic location, or other pertinent demographics. So why does this matter? Firstly, we know this matters because we have the data to prove it. According to research, targeted emails account for 36% of email sales versus 22% from non-targeted messages. Targeting your messages works this well because it allows you to send the right message to the right person and thereby maximize your chance of a conversion. At the same time, though, you'll avoid sending too many irrelevant messages to your list, which can eventually prevent them from opening your future correspondence at all. Of all the metrics you can use to segment your list, though, perhaps the most valuable is the level of interest metric. This refers to the amount of interest that this particular subscriber has shown by opening your messages, by clicking on links, or by scrolling all the way to the bottom. You can even use cookies in order to see whether subscribers have ever visited your checkout page. What this then allows you to do is to send your final messages that will attempt to convert your most interested readers, instead of sending these to everyone on your list and thereby potentially losing subscribers. It is very rare for a cold lead to buy from you. Rather, you will generally build interest and trust over time, and then pull the trigger in order to get a sale. By knowing how interested a subscriber is, you can do this incredibly effectively. And of course, you can also send messages to previous buyers who you know have an interest and a willingness to buy. Most autoresponders include list segmentation tools, so make use of them and see if they can drive your campaign forward. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.